Somebody call the law. Somebody call the law. It got to be illegal for me to be so wrong. What up, though, heist man? The folk talk that talk, ghetto news and opinions, man. Battle Raps Punching Bag is back on the scene. Y'all know who I'm talking about, man. I'm talking about Jim's, Mr. Stop Being Dirty himself. Um, I call him Battle Rap Punching Bag because, you know, he had a few altercations out here in these streets, man. You know, he got into it with goods. He got into it with this dude right here. I don't know who he is, but it happened on the streets. But he back, man. He um he left because he had some unsavory things to say about black people, black women. Um, you know, he said some things, man. And um, I think his heart was broken to some, to some, to some. His girl got took by somebody, and he just got all mad. He was upset. But he back, man. He back like Nino Brown. Y'all remember that on um, what's that movie? New Jack City. He said it's bigger than Nino Brown. I got the list to prove it. And the um the list he talking about, man. Whoa, like first of all, he came in by the fly. He came in by the fly saying by the fly was calling him crying and all this stuff because of the Kenny Lewis stuff happened with Jay Black. Mr. Shake your hand, shake my hand. You know that stuff, man. It happened with Kenny Lewis. He had a couple of counts, but he said, yo, he, he wasn't feeling that because, you know, by the fly, he shouldn't have said nothing. If you ain't going to say something to something to something, check his blog out, man. It's about 30 minutes long on the Just Gems channel, man. Um, but yo, he had that to say. I'm saying he throwing people up under the bus, man. I'm talking about another person he threw up under the bus. What's, what's my man name? RBE, RBE, Mr. AIP himself. He said, yo, AIP, look, you helped me sneak in the blicky at an event one time, man. Like, come on, man. How are you going to say that, man, about that man who helped you out? Why are you going to tell the business like that? That's, that's dirty, man. That is dirty. You shouldn't have did that, yo. That was kind of disrespectful right there. That man let you sneak in the thing, and he said it happened in New York, so you know the laws up there. Hey, look, man, Plexico burst. Cheddar Bob himself, and he went to jail for a whole year, so that was crazy. And the last person he talked about, man, he threw up under that bus was Debo, Mr. Queen of the Ring. He said, yo, you talk about everybody else, let's talk about when um AIP put them hands on you, walked you up out of the vent, and you had your whole crew ready to smash him. You know, y'all was about to... Hey, he said, you don't know if y'all was going to win and who was going to win and who's not going to win or not. Whatever. I don't know. But, yeah, you throwing a lot of people up under the bus, man. You've been gone for, you say, two months. You got to protect your peace and all this stuff. And you come back just swinging away. Like, come on, man. We got to do better than that, man. But, yo, we definitely going to be talking about this Friday right here on this channel because I go live every Friday talking about stuff just like this. You just got to come through and holler at me, man. Hit that like button, the comment button, the share button, the subscribe button, the notification bell. All them good buttons you got to hit to get this pippin' that I'm putting out when I put it out. Let me know in the comment section what you think about this. Do we have any validity? Does anybody even rock with any of this stuff he's saying? Anybody care? I don't know. I seen it on Twitter like yesterday. It was like, oh, what's my man name? Piper Boy Williams. He was like, yo, Jim's got a blog out. I'm looking like, hmm. he back. Okay, that's what's up. So today I seen it. What's my man name? DNA Tooth. He was like, yo. Jim said, AIP, hey, let him sneak the blicky. And I'm like, oh, what is this? <laughs> let me see what it's all about. I did. I'm doing this video now to share with you. For me, to you. Anyway, like I said, I go live on the channel every Friday at 9 p.m. Come through and holler at your boy. Heist man, the folk. Talk that talk. Ghetto news and opinion. This is a dangerous group that groups that we're dealing with now. All right. This time, but I'll be back. And sooner than you think. Wherever there's prejudice, ignorance, inequality, I'll be there.